My name is Jamie Brothwell. Uh, I work for Exertis UK. Um, I run the AV business. Uh, my job role is Chief Sales and Commercial Officer, uh, and I'm responsible for the audiovisual business uh, in the UK. Um, I've been with Exertis uh, now for 10 years, uh, which I can't quite believe. And I feel very privileged that I've actually worked for a decade in two of what I believe are the leading distributors in the UK, starting my career over at Midwich, and where I spent over 10 years, um, now 10 years at Exertis, and in the middle, the filling of the sandwich of my career, Samsung. Uh, so I think I've got quite a broad uh, experience in terms of distribution, but also vendor land. Um, and I've, over the course of the 10 years that I've worked at Exertis, I've, I've covered various roles. I initially started uh, managing the print business. Uh, I then managed our business accessories business uh, and mobile accessories business and then for the last three, now over three years, been managing the AV organisation. You say new warehouse and we say new culture and you know all these things have been um, part of our journey for the last 10 years. We actually opened our warehouse 10 years ago um, and it's a purpose-built facility. It's over 550,000 square foot. Uh, it's the equivalent of 10 football pitches in size and the height of 10 double-decker buses. And it is a phenomenal facility. We own it, we built it ourselves, and we're very proud of it. And our next day dispatch is, is actually 99.4%, which is industry leading. Uh, we've seen good growth. Uh, and for us as an AV business, uh, year to date we're 15% up um, in a market that's very challenged right now. Last year we actually grew 25%, so the proof is clearly in the numbers that that's driving the right results. For me, sustainability is no longer a buzzword. Um, I think a lot of people spoke about sustainability for a long time, but actually, what are they doing about it? And I think that certainly with our larger partners and certainly within the AV industry, there is a huge uh, amount of focus now within the tenders uh, that our customers are completing to win business focused around D&I, but also sustainability. And we've invested heavily in this space. So we've got a team of eight people that are dedicated to sustainability in the organization. And they are available to our customers to work with them on tender response, support them with any questions, uh, work with them in terms of sharing best practice. Um, and we've put a huge amount of focus in that area. We're close to uh, achieving our ISO 14001 standard. Uh, we've got renewable energy in all of our sites. We've got LED lighting now within all of our facilities, an EV fleet now for our, all of our staff. So, you know, we believe that, you know, from, from our perspective, not just as a business, but as human beings, we have a moral responsibility to drive a greater tomorrow. And that's what we're trying to do. You know, we want the future to be, uh, you know, a great place for, for everybody. And, um, you know, we have to look at how we drive efficiencies. And, and actually, I think that, you know, for me, going out and visiting customers, as I do, it's, it's something that people really are looking at now. I think it's driving the purchase decision, whereas I think traditionally uh, integrators, resellers are looking at how, how can I sell 5p on an order, but I might place five different orders with five different distributors to, to deliver me that extra five pence. Now it's a situation of actually, how do I consolidate my distribution? How do I make sure that I get all my goods in one place at one time efficiently, and also doing the right thing in terms of our carbon footprint? from an efficiency perspective of, of the integrator as well. Knowing you're getting all your product for your install turning up at the same place at the same time is, is driving efficiency. The last three years have been challenging uh, from the point of where we are were to the point of where we are today. But I'm incredibly proud of our team, of our people, um, and very grateful to our customers that have embraced um, our new team and new ways of working. And we're both benefiting from that, I believe. And we've really tried to take a human lens uh, with our customers, working closely with them, understanding their pipeline, who is the end user, and, and being flexible to help them win business. And that's been really key to what I believe has been a very successful three years.